Hey all you horror fanatics, welcome back to John's Horror Corner, I'm John and we are going to do another short horror film reaction and this short horror film today is called Curve. Uh, it's been described as a disturbing horror short film. Uh, it was the winner of best short awards at both Fantastic Fest and Sigit uh, Sig 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 something in 2016. Um, anyway, so it was written and directed by... Tim Egon, Tim Egan. Um, apparently, it took him only like eight hours to write this short, and then um, a very short time after that, just to start uh, filming and shooting it. But so the synopsis is: clinging to a curved surface high above a sentient abyss, a girl has to cover a few feet back to safety before she loses grip. And the YouTube channel that's putting this out, I will have it in the description of this video when it's posted. So without further to do, let's go ahead. Actually, right before we get into it, if you're checking out my channel for the very first time, I do short horror film reactions on Mondays and Tuesdays. Uh, once in a while, I'll do trailer reviews. Uh, I haven't done those in a little while. Um, and then Fridays, Fridays I do my... Uh, horror gameplays every Friday. So I play horror gameplays. I record my reactions as I'm playing them. So all of you can see how scared I get. And um, a lot of these psychological horror games are freaking gnarly. So Fridays is when those are posted. Uh, just click the link tree in my de my description or in my bio so you can have access to all my socials, uh, my photography page and all that stuff. So. Uh, just go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like this video, please share it with all your friends, and let's get right into it. Ooh. It's so soothing listening to the ocean. Once in a while I'll have, um... Spotify play like ocean and nature sounds while I'm sleeping just to help me like relax at night. That looks like blood all over her shoe. Looks like blood stains. Whoa, whoa. Oh man. That made me jump a little. Man, she looks tore up. I wonder how long she's been there. See the way her legs bent too? Ooh, hopefully it's not broken. Oh, damn. That would be hard to try and climb out of. Oh, man. You gotta take it slow. You gotta... Oh, move your foot. Move your foot. Something's gonna grab it. Something's gonna grab it. Move your foot. Oh. Oh man, we got to take it slow, slowly, slowly work your way up. Any fast movements, you're probably just going to slip. Keep your hands dry too, because if your hands get sweaty, if your palms are sweaty because of mom's spaghetti, then you're probably just going to slip into the abyss. There you go. There you go. Nice and slow, nice and slow. Breathe. There you go. Slow breathing. Slow breathing. Keep your heart rate down. I'm talking to her as if like she can hear me.
Look like she has some good grip on the bottom of her shoes, so that could be a big help. There you go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, my God. This is going to be impossible. Go oh, breathe. I wonder if you can use a sweater to help put grip. On that concrete. No, probably not. It'd probably be more slippery. You need rubber. Dang. She can't even get her leg out. Her leg being bent like that is like what's helping hold her. Ooh, man. Oh, yeah. Wiping the blood off so it's not so slippery. Okay. Man, her leg is... She's going to lose blood flow through her leg. If she hasn't already. This is giving me anxiety. I guess both our hands are jacked up. I wonder what happened before this. Like, how did she end up there? Did she make a deal with the devil and it go and it went terribly wrong? Here you go, little baby steps, baby steps. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, okay. Come on. I would be sweating so much right now if I was in that position. Probably because I'm fat and heavy, so I gotta hold up all my body weight, which is gonna exhaust my body even more. Oh, okay, okay. Good job, good job. Little by little. Oh my gosh, girl, you have my anxiety going crazy right now. What a position to be in. It's like someone used to be on that side. Don't think about it. Don't think about it. Go breathe, breathe. There we go. There we go. Don't look at it. There's nothing there. Don't worry about the other side. What is that sound? What? Is there like is there like an echo of the flashback that happened on that side? Wow, okay. That is crazy. There we go. Little by little, little by little. You got this. You got this.
that rain? Oh no, you gotta be kidding me. That is so unfair. Yeah, that is so unfair. Now it's just impossible. A pretty long necklace. Okay. That's actually not a bad idea. Use a necklace to get a get a grip, huh? Oh, where'd she go? Oh man. Oh my god, like that had my anxiety going crazy. That actress, so the actress, uh the girl, Laura Jane Turner, man, she did such a remarkable job. Man, this was a trippy, trippy, uh, like they said, a disturbing short horror film. Like being in that position, oh man, that's that sucks. But that, like, like Tim, I want to know more. Like, I like, how did she get there? Uh, what's in the abyss? Like, what's what's going on? You know, I I hope there's more uh, spinoffs or more short horror films that link to this because. That was a really, really, really good concept. I really like that a lot. I hope you guys really like that a lot, too. Um, so that's it for today. I um, hope you guys stick around for the next short horror film reaction. Check out my gameplays on Friday, and we will see you guys next time.